In the financial advisor industry, a successful partnership is represented by two equally important groups, the clients who have a need and the advisors who consult them. These are their stories. Uh, so I've seen this happen throughout the course of working with my clients. And oftentimes I know, you know, personal friends and family have had this happen to them as well. Um, but I want to talk a little bit about estate planning and beneficiaries on accounts. So oftentimes when you go and get your estate plan done, your attorney provides funding instructions for how to properly layer beneficiaries across all of your accounts, which is great. But when it comes to checking accounts, if you have a beneficiary on your checking account, and if something were to happen to you, that beneficiary is unable to get access to that account until a death certificate is often provided, when the bank has hoops that they need to jump through, paperwork, things of that nature. Um, so oftentimes, it actually makes sense to have your child, uh, your trustee, as a joint owner on that account. And why would you do that? It's so that way, in the event of something happening, they have immediate access to that account. Um, oftentimes, when a, or when a somebody passes, there's funeral expenses, there's things that need to be cleaned up and they need access to those dollars. Um, so just a thought, um, there's no right or wrong way to do it, but oftentimes uh, the beneficiary has hoops to jump through, it takes time, whereas if they're a joint owner, they have immediate access.